All right, in this video, we're going to look at how to exclude multi listing items in eBay uh, results. So, for instance, let's say we're looking for a keyboard. And a lot of times, when you're just doing the best match, it may not be too bad. But this is what a multi listing looks like. And here's, here's why it's bad. So, let's say you want to do it buy now, buy it now, it's pretty popular. And then a lot of people do pricing. Um, or price and shipping lowest first. They want to see what the lowest price they can get. And then if you do that and start looking down through the results, um, you'll see how they have it set up here. So, so see how these multi listings. So is it a dollar thirty two or is it seventeen thirty one? Well, most likely it's going to be seventeen thirty one. They put it like this so their results will come up at the first. So it's really kind of a um, it's really a scam. And eBay hasn't put a stop to it, which I'm surprised. So this has actually been going on for a long time. Um, but but you can see it's kind of a pain because you got to go through all of these listings see to try to find something that actually shows the price and as you can see if you keep scrolling down here okay like so this would be one 788 so you know it's going to be 788 this is seven uh, um, 67 to 2337 so it most likely it's going to be 2337 um, so you have to keep scrolling down till you can find the results that you want. So really what you want to do is is have a checkbox somewhere where you can get rid of these multi listings. And there isn't one. There's really no way around it. But um, somebody did come up with a, a kind of a way to do it. But you have to do it every time. So for instance, what you do is press the F12 key on your keyboard and see how it brings up this console window. And then you just click on console right here. And then down here just paste in this code and I'll leave the code in the uh, description of this video and once you uh, place that code in there just press the enter key and watch what happens and then you can actually close this out um, look it takes them all away <laughs> it's pretty cool so that's really the only way around it you have to have that code um, I think somebody's made something that integrates in with the browser but it's kind of a pain but it's just a simple code if you do a lot of searching it could be handy if you if you don't it might be kind of hard to find every time but it definitely works because you can see right here um, you can actually see the the price listing so it gets out all of those um, scams out of there all right if you have any questions or if you have a better way to do this I'd love to hear it um, some a few people thought you might be able to go to an advanced options and make a change but I couldn't find anything in there and neither could they but um, if you find an easier way to do this I'd love to hear hear your uh, thoughts on it uh, leave it in the comments below oh uh, please uh, be sure to uh, like and subscribe all right thank you very much and have a nice day